Hi guys. Okay, I know you guys are gonna look at me and say, hey, you did a brow tutorial already. But um, the reason why I'm doing this brow tutorial is because I want to do a review on Anastasia's brow um, highlighting brow kit and a couple of other, like the new brow pen and uh, like the brow gel and all. So I'm gonna show you how that works. Um, I'm sure a lot of you already have these products and if you don't, you should go get it. It's really, really, really good. I love it. Okay, I'm going to start off by applying the brow pen and the reason why I'm applying this first is because it adheres to the skin and it adheres to the hair also and this is what it looks like and I'm using it in, um, in the deep shade, universal deep shade, yeah. So I'm going to apply this here. I like to use this pen mostly where you have like um, empty areas, very sparse. I like it because it lasts all day. So you can just do that and wear that alone. But I still like, with, with the Anastasia um, brow pen, I usually like to add a little powder over it. But this is nice to get it to stick on. So that's the pen. I really, really like this. I like to use this even when I'm in a rush. And I really want to, I throw it in my bag actually and I keep it with me just in case, you know. The little tip races comes off or especially with me wearing a scarf it always like rubs against this part here and it, you know like I'll have like an empty space there and I like to use it for that so for quick touch-ups this is awesome the brow pen now my next step is gonna be to apply the highlight um, the highlighting kit and it comes um, this is what it looks like And on the inside, when you open it, it's like this. Um, I really, really like this. It has three shades here. It has the light, and the medium, and then the dark. I love this because I do um, uh, makeup for other people, and it's always nice to have like all the shades in one little kit instead of having like a bunch of different colors in different kits. And these are the highlighting powders I was saying. You see how shimmery they are? I usually don't like to put shimmers like that underneath my brows, but these shades here also you can use them on your lids as eyeshadows and these here the same thing and you can also use these all wet or dry So now you notice that I have a lot of hairs that fall out of place it's because my um, brow hairs are kind of long. Sometimes I cut them, sometimes I don't. Sometimes I need the length over here to make the brow a little longer in the corner. So Anastasia also has brow gels that keep them in place. What I like about it is that it comes in different shades. It comes in, um, let's see here. I'm going to put on the side all the shades it comes in, but this one is espresso. This is a lighter shade. This one's the lightest. And then, this one's the clear. I usually like to use either the darkest or the clear for myself. Those are the three shades mix each other. Um, but it's also nice to have all the shades. These are not all the shades, I believe there's more shades than these. But it's nice to have all the shades for clients. So, I'm going to be using the, well, since my brows already look really dark, I kind of did them a little too dark. Um, I'm going to use the clear, and I love this because it sets it. And what's great about it, it is not flaky, it doesn't turn out, um, I, I know you guys know that I use hairspray if you watch my video for my brows. Um, I like this a lot because I usually get scared of using brow mascaras because I'm sure all of you have experience where it turns out white after a little while. This one doesn't. So it's really really nice. It doesn't look shiny or anything like that. So it's very natural and it keeps them in place for sure. Okay, so this product I can honestly say I was so excited to try this. I couldn't wait to put this on. And it's called the um, Illuminate Eyeshadow Palette. And this is what that looks like. Yep. This is so... Cool. I'm going to open show you the colors. It 
these are the shades okay so the reason why I really like the illuminate um, eyeshadow palette is because you're supposed to notice that these fine lines and wrinkles well I have a lot of them I don't know but um, if you notice these here in an hour you supposed the they're supposed to look a little smoother I guess and then it's supposedly within 28 days you're supposed to see a difference in the eye beauty now I haven't used it for that long I've been using it um, about a week maybe a week and a half two weeks now but not every day so I haven't um, really notice it, but it does look really pretty. It's very subtle. It's very natural look. Um, I'm going to do a tutorial with uh, some of the colors in there, so you'll be able to see what they look like. If you want them to be really intense, you just add a little water, which I tried and it definitely works. It really intensifies the colors. Um, so I will be updating you guys. I'm going to continue using this palette more than any other thing on my lids, especially for everyday looks, and I'll let you know if it truly does um, enhance the eye beauty. Or maybe you guys will be able to see it when you see my next video. You let me know if you see a difference in my eyes, all right? So I'm going to get started with the tutorial. My eyes are already prepped. Um, my brows are already done. So I'm going to begin. I'm going to be putting this one on today. I'm going to show you how that looks. I'm going to do a tutorial on this one. Okay, so first I'm going to apply the light eyeshadow on my lid without wetting it, just so you guys can see the difference. And then I'm going to wet it and then apply it uh, over it, and then you'll see how much more intense the color will look. Now another product that I love, and I'm, I'm truly, my honest opinion, I'm so in love with this tweezer. I think it's even better than Tweezer Man tweezers, is the Anastasia tweezer. I swear, I already told everybody about this tweezer. My sister is out to buy it, my niece is out to buy it, everybody's like, I want that tweezer. It's so awesome. It grabs the most tiniest, tiniest hairs. I mean, with ease. I absolutely love it. So you're about to go buy a Tweezer Man, think again and try, try the Anastasia, Anastasia before you go um, for the Tweezer Man Tweezer. It's awesome. Now this is the final look. It's very natural. It's not typical look of um, a typical look that I usually do for tutorials, but I do do these kind of looks when I go out for like every day or just like a simple quick look. It's very easy, um, very simple. 